What is going on guys, it's your boy Station Live, and welcome you guys back to my channel. In this video, we're going to be talking about the best gaming monitors that you guys can get this Christmas. Now, we've already covered the best um, microphones, cameras, and stuff like that. Now, we're going to cover gaming monitors. So, if you're looking to get a gaming monitor from your parents, from grandma, granddad, or whoever, families and friends, this is just a little idea on the price range and what to ask for. Now, branding, I don't think there's too much of a difference to worry about. Um, as long as if say you're doing like FPS shooters, uh, FPS shooters, sorry, you want a real low response time. So a refresh response time. So you want it as close to one milliseconds as possible. Now there is some really cheap one millisecond ones out there, um, but you can also get two, three, or five milliseconds. I suggest anything lower than two is the best. So two milliseconds or one millisecond. So that means as you're running around shooting, you're getting it fed to your screen for you to see in a real quick refresh rate. So I'm gonna show you guys the monitor that I've got right now. So this is the gaming monitor. Sorry if it keeps flicking on and off because I haven't got the Elgato hooked up. But this is mine, it's an Asus 27 inch gaming monitor. Now they do say that the monitors that you guys have, sorry about my bag here behind it. Uh, it's not a very thick monitor this one. You can get them on eBay pretty cheap. But they do say uh, if you want a gaming monitor, the best gaming monitor to have is a smaller screen. So instead of having a 27 inch, just get like a 15 inch. Now the reason I got a 27 is because my eyes ain't too good. And even just sat here, I do struggle. Oh, I've got some bleach on my trousers. <laughs> but even sat just here, you know, without my contact lens in or whatever, which I do actually have my contact lens case there. Um, it's quite hard for me to see. So having a low response time always, always helps and a bigger screen if you've got bad eyes. And this needs to clean because you can see it's bloody marks all over it. So yeah, low, low response time always helps. Let me just get up my game capture here real, real quick. I was just looking at vlog music there. And then you guys should be able to see it on the screen, right, cutting in and out all the time. But that is pretty much what you're looking for, guys. It's a low response time. We will go into detail on a website in a minute to have a look at the prices of ones that you can get. So there you go, guys. See, 27 inch, that's perfect for me. Um, but they always say smaller the better. So come on, what are you doing? What are you cutting in and out? Come on, don't freak out on me. There we go. So I'd say 15 inch, 15 inch monitor, which is probably gonna be about, what, from here across. So not much more. And then the height's probably only gonna be about here. And as long as you sit really close, guys, the smaller the screen, the better and cheaper is, like the cheaper it's gonna be, all right? So the, che the smaller the screen, the cheaper it's gonna be, but as long as it's one millisecond, it don't really matter. So let's just jump onto our website now and we're gonna have a look at comparisons, have a look at some uh, different specs and stuff and what to look out for and what to ask your parents for this Christmas. Let's go. <laughs> on the curry slash pc world website once again but i need to say to you guys right now don't get the monitor just because it says gaming in it okay or it doesn't even have to say gaming in it that's a big mistake a lot of people make they see it says gaming monitor and they just instantly want it or it doesn't say gaming in it and they think it's not the right one for them any computers or any tv sorry or monitor is going to be great for you guys now i highly suggest either an asus which you can get online or samsung so obviously a lot of you guys are from the UK, so you're gonna have this Curry or PC World pretty close to you. And I suggest this uh, Samsung monitor here, 22 inch LED monitor. This is quite a good monitor, but one thing that you need to find out is if it's got speakers in it, because Jody recently be built, uh, bought a monitor, sorry, and it didn't have any speakers. So that was a bit weird that it didn't come with any speakers. So you need to make sure that it has speakers on it. Now if we're just looking from the refresh time, so it's 1080p, you don't want 720p. I know I said 720p for recording with a camera on my last video. You want to have 1080p on this, guys. Now, you can make a 720p uh, monitor or 
uh, TV look like 1080p by how far away you sit from the monitor. So if you sit at least a meter to a meter and a half away from a 720p screen, it will actually look 1080p because the pixels will be smaller and harder for you to pick out and see. So it will look 1080p. So that's just a little trickery that you could do with your eyes there. Um, we've got this Logic one, this is 720p, like I said, you need to stay away from that. We've got HP ones, not too good. Maybe we're gonna have to bump the range up a bit. Go on to the second page here. And then we'll go and have a look on Amazon in a minute and see what we can find. Oh, so we've got a curved one. I'm not too sure about curved ones. I'm trying to get you guys to buy curved ones for the minute. Um, we've got an Acer one. Acer is a great brand for monitors and TVs. So we've got this Acer one here, but I still don't think this one comes with speakers. I'm not too sure, but it doesn't really matter if you guys use a headset. Um, it just means you obviously won't be able to get any sound out of this. You just have to use a headset, but I will show you ones, uh, the Asus ones on Amazon in a moment that do have speakers built into them. So obviously it's got one HDMI port on this, one VGA, one DVI. All you're gonna be using guys is the HDMI. Uh, if you got, have got to plug multiple things in, then obviously this one isn't going to be the one for you. And as you can see here, response time, one milliseconds. We're just going to head straight over to Amazon, I think, um, and have a look on Amazon, because I think things are going to be a lot better. Looking at the Asus range. Uh, Asus monitor. Okay, right. So we have the 24 inch here right off the bat, which is a one millisecond response time, as you can see. Brilliant little monitor. Uh, the controls on the screen as well to press um, we have 1080p one millisecond response time perfect 116 pounds absolute bargain so this is a great monitor to go for anything asus is pretty much made for gamers i just need to put that one out there now um <clears throat> let's have the asus vc monitor 1080p low light flicker free yeah they're all gonna be flick free they, they just try to do like little fancy words to try and get you to buy it guys like i said by putting gaming in there but it's the specs you need to look at here um i can't really see ah, so this one's got speakers as i said let's see speaker description loud speakers so if you don't want to use your headset all the time then an asus monitor is definitely going to be one for you to go for actually so they got like a specs comparison here have they the looks of it they have so this is the Asus VC239H. This was 1080p. This one's only got a five millisecond response time though, so it's a lot higher. Yeah, it's 120 pounds, but it's a lot higher response time ways. You can come across to this Asus monitor, um, which is 1080p, but I don't think it has external speakers on this one. This one is only uh, it's LED, 24 inch, 1080p. Uh, our aspect ratio is only 4.4 by 3. You want to look for 16 by 9. So that one's not going to be the one for you guys either. BenQ's another great monitor as well. You've got to put that one out there. BenQ's, a lot of people in America get BenQ's. BenQ's are really hot in America. Um, this one here seems to be great. This is the one that I've got, I think. 16 by 3. 166 pound this is the asus monitor here 27 inch and uh, yeah this is the one that i've got so thousand pixels response time where's the response time doesn't say what the response time oh yeah one millisecond down here one millisecond four see the bang q's even got a four millisecond response time if you look here um built-in speakers all right so this yeah so my 27 inch does have built-in spe built speakers um, this one here has got a five. Right, so so guys, if you're looking for something that's really, really cheap, um, this one here, the Asus here for £119, does have built-in speakers, okay? It says here, built-in speakers. So it's got built-in speakers, but it is five millisecond response time. So 1080p, five millisecond response time. So if you are looking for something that's cheap, cheap, this is the one to go for, guys. Now, if you're a big freak about response time, trust me, one millisecond to five milliseconds is not a big, big difference. I would suggest if you want to keep on the smaller screen size, because this one's 23 inch, instead of going for the 27 like mine, 116 pound, this one here. This will give you one millisecond, but you will not have the external speakers. So that is another drawback on that one there. Um, LG, I've got one here, 25 inch. 
built in. I know that doesn't even have speakers either. I'm trying to look for ones with speakers for you guys. Um, the BenQ does have speakers, but it's only four milliseconds. Um, so the only one really is 27 inch, the one that I have got. One millisecond response time, uh, 1080p, um, but it's 27 inch. So it, it depends, guys, what you want to go for. I mean, it's 166 pounds. You can probably find them cheaper elsewhere. But I don't know, guys. Let's see if they do like a 15 inch monitor. I'm pretty sure they do because a lot of people always have the small, small monitors. Let's see, the price just goes. This is a 28 inch, 350 quid. I'd say the one that I suggested, the same one as me, as same one as mine, is probably your best bet. I cannot see anything cheaper, guys. Honestly, I'm trying to look here. This is what I'm trying to do right now. Is look like just raw with you guys to try and find it. And my one here just seems to be the best deal that you can find for an Asus monitor. Um, let's try Samsung uh, gaming TV. Don't write monitor. Uh, 15 inch because I know you guys are going to want the best you're going to want one millisecond and you're going to want it 15 inch um, I don't think you can do it like that anymore like all monitors are just huge now it's 91 pound this is a great little bargain here so this is Samsung one um, where's the specs on this Samsung 21 inch doesn't have built in none of these have built in sound systems how strange five milliseconds all the way along across the Samsung range so you're not going to get good milliseconds with Samsung I'm afraid it is going to be let's see if there's any BenQ's BenQ monitor let's see if BenQ do any any good uh, is it going to show up like the ranges again so I can compare yes it is right this BenQ oh here we go right £103, uh, 4 millisecond response, but it does have built-in speakers, so we've, we've cut down the speed there, um, LCD 16 by 9 which you've always got to look for guys, okay, do not get this 4.3 aspect ratio, uh, it's 1080p, built-in speakers, but it's only 4, we're looking for lower than 4, um, £116, that's back on the ASUS, <laughs> Uh, 99 pound two milliseconds doesn't so it looks like you're sacrificing the speakers for the quicker refresh time that's what it seems to be like uh, Asus what's that, 23 inch monitor here built-in speakers but it's five milliseconds so I would say guys the best one is the one that I've got I cannot find anything better for you guys um, everything seems to be just stupid ass like the, it's either response time or speakers and I know a lot of you guys are gonna want speakers you're not gonna want to wear headsets all the time but i would say this 27 inch and just sit back a bit if it's too big for your eyes or whatever and it's too close but this is the one i've got guys and this one just works like a treat for me like it's absolutely amazing um if you want me to get into gaming pcs i'm not too sure on gaming pcs and what to get to be fair but i could make a gaming pc video um but yeah guys i do like this 27 inch like i said one millise one millisecond response time built-in speakers this is going to be the one for you guys enjoy the video smash a like if you learned something smash a like let me know in the comment section if there's anything i've missed or if you guys do know of a better game monitor this is just me and my personal experience there is millions of monitors out there there's millions of different companies out there guys so if you know a better company drop a link in the comment section and let me know guys so then i can inform other people and let other people know in the description so yeah guys i'll see you on my next video hope you guys have a fantastic christmas we're literally like two and a half weeks away I'll see you guys later. Peace out.